I drew a sketch of a monkey and then I cut it out with the styrofoam cutter and then I cut out the tail separately. I programmed the border here with Mark Kit using the hardware and I set the first server to 135, the, the angle, and the second one to zero so I can get the specific motion. Maybe. <laughs> I made a boy with the hat and it moves. <laughs> okay, so I first I set the um the blocks and showed it like how much time to repeat and the angle is supposed to go. And when I program it, this is what it does. I press play. It makes the hat go out. As you guys can see, it's supposed to be a face. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, so I just had to make a crab and have its hand open and close. That's my nice crab. And I use a styrofoam cutter to get the shape. And I like SpongeBob, too. I like to make hearts. <laughs> and I thought it would be easy to like cut the hardware. So I set up the hardware, which is um, server one, and um, I plugged it into A2. And, um, over here is um, A2. Oh my God. Wait. Let's not go to zero. Oh, so made a robot. <laughs> and made sure you didn't have it say hi. Like, wait on Oh, yeah. And my idea was to have a chicken and egg, and so the egg would crack, and you would see the chick come out. And so I programmed it with the servo one so that it can repeat 10 times and go at a 90 degree angle each time. And so when you play it, it should. So, so um, I'm Joshua, and um, it's my third year here. And what I made today is a warrior, and he has a really big arm. That will just uh, he has two axes attached, but one one of them will move like a swing motion, so it'd be like chopping an axe. So if I started to play it. <laughs> you know, make a chopping motion. And yeah, that's my project. Um, so when I previously made, it took me a while to make. A very hard project. Dot, you know, pack made. It's simply simplest um, of a way of a saying a servo, because pac man just opens and closes. But then it took me a while, because I actually realized that that was actually going to be really hard. Mm -hmm.